hi my dear friend uh, so how are you doing and i hope that you are actually uh, keeping on uh, with me so we are so close to uh, finishing this project together so i have had a lot of fun and also uh, i had pleasure to work with uh, someone like you on this project so uh, i hope that you are actually getting so much value from this playlist so if you do don't forget to let me know in the comment section below so what i'm going to be doing today is that we are going to take a look at uh, our own stages at the authentication user stages we are going to take a look at how we can edit our own stages or delete it and we can also uh, just make a way to uh, for us to actually view our own statuses so uh, this is has to be actually doing with the last episode if you haven't seen it before so i will be i will make sure to leave a link to the full playlist in the description so you can check it out when you want so you can keep on with me so uh before we get started actually don't forget to uh join our learn no code family so you can do that just by click on subscribe so you will be joining this family and i will, I will be more than happy to see you as a member of the family and also turn on the bell icon so we will not miss my upcoming content so with that out of the way let's get into it so here what we are going to be doing is that so let's first uh, get the circle the green one you see it here uh, actually let's just click there and uh, try to just uh, control and see to copy it so here it was copied to my clip uh, my clipboard so here if i went to that page if i just click it here or on this one if you see that I have already uh, used a stack because a red circle was already there so I can just paste that there uh, just like that you can uh, switch the the order if you like because that is not what we need uh, you know so here we want to continue to be uh, on top of that uh, yes in, inside the stack so uh, just to show you here so you see the continue is upon uh the circle image so now that container uh, is what actually uh will so for the it, it will have a conditional action and uh, for me and for you my beloved friend it's an opportunity for you to actually discover something new when it comes to conditional visibility right so uh we can go to uh condition visibility for that container here so what we are going to be doing is that we are going to uh, make it go with this field so if uh, which is uh, i will show it to you here which is the status mode so since it is a boolean then it matches it matches actually with the nature of a condition visibility since a condition visibility is always on and off, on or off true or false so it's uh, also a boolean so now what we're going to be doing is that we're going to so if the status mode was on then this will be will show up the, the red circle if the status uh, mode was false then this not will not actually show up anyway so uh, it's very simple we can go to the user and link it to that field that i have just shown you and you see it is a switch icon which means that it is a boolean right so we can click there and that is the only thing we can do so now let's actually uh, do something new to this one to uh, in in this video so what I, I will be actually doing is to just uh, uh, do pretty much the same thing i have done here or so maybe we can just copy and paste it and do some ch uh, small changes to it uh, because here it is called my status this is when we are going to be taking a look at our own statuses uh, I hope that you have got the idea by the way so here it is very simple so since these lists are pretty much the same the only difference is that this one is showing me the statuses of other people this will show my own status right that is the thing that we can do uh, so here uh, if I just click here for example uh, we have two less view uh, two less views in, in a way so this one should be deleted and then we can just duplicate this one and check one here so just one of them and uh, so uh, you see we have a duplication version of it so you can just uh, put one uh, here so sorry because so me so that is exactly what we need but the thing that we can change here is that so i will show you what i have to change let's first off start by editing the backend query so go there and click on edit backend query so now you can come here the first thing is that you only want a single document this is very easy so here when it comes to the filters so the user id has so this is not a filter that we need remove that so uh, 
uh, for now the feature the new feature is the status mode so um, yes keep it you can keep it and uh, feature 2 is the UID is so uh, so uh, so uh, this was actually um, this me this uh, was useful to uh, check other people out of that but now we we want the user ID to be equal to ours because here we just want our own document so let's reverse it to equal to here we can confirm and you see we are going to have some errors because here we have we are using uh, here equal to and here so uh, we are so this is uh, so you know that uh, the only problem I have so sorry because I have, didn't read that correctly but the user ID has to be equal to this re reference of the authentication user right confirm and if we confirm we, we are not going to have any problem whatsoever and now we so we have the same actions we can do pretty much the same and if you are looking for how we can add a new status then this is uh, the 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 or actually this is the button where we or, or actually that we use to make or create a new status right so now i believe that the app is uh, pretty much uh, done and uh, we still need to do only one thing before we finish this which is uh, the offline and online mode so what, how do i know that someone is offline or online so we are going to take a look at that anyway so uh, actually let's uh, keep it to the next step and uh, i hope that you have actually enjoyed this step and uh, uh, it was very simple and easy so if you like it don't forget to give this video a thumbs up so it can appear to more people so i highly appreciate that so uh, let's actually move on to the next step so guys here this is just a test of the app so i have made a change in the plan so i don't want to go in depth this app uh, you know because uh, here on youtube we usually do something that is uh, something like basic but when it comes to for example uh, a very advanced app so you will find that on a course on a paid course or a premium course because this is going to be a personalized high level knowledge so let's actually make it simple since we are just beginners so let's actually make it simple right so here i will go to the stages right here i can see my own stages i can go there you see that uh, so by the way leo has two stages here you can see he had my image and i can scroll like this i can see the gym see here so this is the two statuses of uh, Leo right and here John so he has one status you could, it cannot sc scroll and it is not either a page view so you know everything that we have made is working so after a day everything will be deleted and you will not see any statuses unless <laughs> these guys added new statuses so uh, this is actually the end of uh, this playlist I really hope that you have actually uh, enjoyed every single second you have spent watching and actually learning from this playlist. I actually try to make smaller videos than I used to do with my previous playlist. So I hope that you are actually getting so much value from this playlist. So uh, if you like it, if you actually like the content that I make for you to help you learn no code in time and uh, help you actually bring your uh, brilliant and amazing and wonderful ideas to life using no code tools and saving yourself tons of time then i really appreciate you support my work on coffee so uh, so this is just my coffee page you can so if you want to support me if you like the content and uh, if you want actually just to show me some love you can either uh, go uh, go with one time you can donate something to me just uh, do that what you can afford or add some custom value this is just some suggested amounts so and don't forget to leave a message so i highly appreciate your support in this way and you can actually or you can join the no code family plan which contains some benefits that may be actually good for you first thing you will be saving 50 percent of all of my coffee shops so for each playlist i will be taking five to ten videos and put them in a premium pack so you will be actually getting 50 percent uh, so they are already cheap they will be you will be getting them even cheaper right so you will be getting exclusive content so some more advanced content such as business tips or a lot of things so i will be thinking of uh, what type of, what type of uh, exclusive content i can provide my 
uh, my beginner's weight so i don't promise you the type or titles but i can actually make some exclusive content for you so you will be getting that uh, benefit as well so here you can so if you have a question or if you have a certain problem with flow you wanna and you wanna some personalized a special tutorial for you so i can make it for you and if you want me to upload uh, to uh mention your name in the video on youtube you can do that so this is a very great uh, opportunity for you people who have problems with photo flow so i can help you fix that with this plan so here here you can actually clone all the products i make on this channel including this one that i'm working on you will find it in the link in the description so you can check it and take it to the next level as a way to for you to have more fun and show your skills and the, your area of creativity and the development right so you can get it you can clone for free you have seen the process of how of how i built it so you can clone it and take it to the next level i highly recommend you do that and finally you will be getting a youtube shout out i will be mentioning your name so you can be known in this community so by the way let's actually give special thanks to my uh, coffee supporters and members as well so let's take a look at them so here they are we have abdullah which is a part of my nocut family and my beloved dear friend leonard brinkers which is uh, which who is actually an, a part of nocut vip this was an old plan so he was a part of that so thank you by the way my dear leonard and here we have Pavlos Mitro, which actually was uh, a no code family member. So, thank you so much, guys. Thank you to all of you for supporting my work. And I uh, invite you to join my coffee page so you can get a lot of benefits and uh, save, save yourself a lot of time and effort. And also contribute in making this channel the biggest one in the no code niche so uh, thank you so much i actually um, i will be actually uh, missing you a lot in this playlist but uh, there are a lot of places that are coming in so if you don't if, if you don't want to miss any of those uh, upcoming content don't forget to turn on the bell icon and also join the the community by subscribing to this channel and uh, until next time happy development and take care of yourself